now uh, when you need to add a power amplifier is if you want um not only more output but better dynamics now a lot of guys that tell you to buy power amplifiers don't actually talk about the the important aspect of a, a power amplifier in your setup and that is dynamics now there is something that uh, a navy receiver or a home theater in a box or a soundbar can give you that a power amplifier can give you and that is um, power pressure that's basically uh, more power output that that uh, immerses you in that um, surround field now when you go to a, a commercial theater maybe um, you are hearing um, a particular scene in the movie comes from the center channel it echoes so loud that you feel that that person is right next to you now it's only a power amplifier that can give you that sort of illusion um, no other um, product out there can actually do that and every receiver uh, can never go as loud as a power amplifier or as um, or as impactful as an, uh, it's a power amplifier it can only try most of uh, the heavy receivers we have in the world are rated uh, rated in a way that it kind of like it doesn't give you exactly what is rated but like they say it it gives you that and uh, you find yourself turning up the volume a lot but you don't get that power dynamics that you're looking for now there is another reason why you need a power amplifier um the wattage of your speaker like basically there are some speakers that are very very power hungry now if you are using speakers that have pretty much very power hungry you'll probably be looking for um power amplifiers that can actually complement uh your setup something that can actually give you um that um subtle output to your speakers and uh give you better clarity in uh, the in the mid-range your high frequency and your bass and um, typically um it's only a power amplifier that can give you strong uh, base uh, that's output to your speakers and uh, with a power amplifier you can actually run better crossover settings to your speakers because uh, there there are some things you might probably want to set up in your crossover uh, if you're using your regular AV receiver you probably won't be able to get that uh, that power effect from a regular AV receiver but with a power amplifier once you calibrate your setup you'll be able to um, get that um, impactful um, set, uh, settings that you, yeah, you that you put on your AV receiver so guys this is just uh, to answer that uh, dude that asked this question dude you seriously need a power amplifier if you have the budget for it now I'm not saying you should go out there and spend all your money buying a power amplifier they are very expensive and um, they are very valuable they offer you more value but uh, they are very expensive nonetheless so uh, there are brands that can still give you something reasonably um, affordable like the Motiva um, Outlaw Audio um, even some older power sound uh, power amplifiers and even Onkyo uh, may create power amplifier too and you could just get that and start out but if you can afford it still use your AV receiver uh, and uh, scale from there and if this helped you out a lot uh, you like this content be sure to subscribe to the channel keep listening and